A Chase Outlaw gets his chance. The Bull Squirrel often lives up to his name. Yeah, a good one here, a good matchup for Outlaw. I, I would look for him just like Claudio, get right back on track and be right back in the thick of this event. Outlaw comes in number three. Remember, Jose Vitor Leme's result last week moved him ahead of Chase in terms of the overall point totals. But Outlaw, facts are facts, right? Having a great year. He has ridden eight of his 12 bulls. You've already highlighted that different personality, that different perspective, and just that forthrightness and really laser focus on each ride. Well, yeah, and, and you know, the standings at this point in the season, that's for you and I to talk about. That, that doesn't concern Chase Outlaw. Outlaw is here to ride, and that's exactly what he's been doing, man. Three top tens last season, but he basically missed two thirds of the year because of the multitude of injuries that we have talked about over the past few months. And when you talk about the Global Cup, this is a guy that we finally get to see at the Global Cup. Was supposed to be on the first two teams, but the injuries have kept him sidelined. Yeah, and I was going to say, right, knock on wood, because I know you don't want me to jinx you and your team, but there's nothing secret about Chase Outlaw, but he's almost right the secret weapon for the Eagles this year because you've wanted him on your team every prior Global Cup. Well, I'm telling you, it's been a big hit not having him there. He'll, he will fill a big void on that team. Hey, hey, hey. It's Outlaw who finds eight seconds worth of nuts <laughs> aboard Squirrel. And what a ride that was. Meanwhile, the bull goes after Frank Newsom, Jesse Byrne right there, and Shorty just likes to laugh while it all happens. <laughs> this is gonna be big right here, man. That was a good ride. Squirrel had a good day. 89 and three quarters, you're not kidding. Well, and, and that's what happens when you match up a really good bull with a great little exciting bull rider and chase outlaw he's aggressive with the outside leg that's just exciting to watch you got to mark him way over top of a bull that had a great day and then here come the guys saving lives again frank knew something you know it just that's what i talk about with well, these bulls are mean and this is like when you get to watch it at a professional level though They've got no chance. Outlaw continues to impress. He's with Kate. Jace, how did you bounce back so quickly from round one and get a big ride like that? Well, I mean, if you dwell on a buck off, I mean, you'll never come, you'll never ride one again. I mean, each day's a new day, and if I buck off, win, lose, or draw, I'm gonna keep taking the fight to them. I mean, you have to. This, like I said last week, I might not ride everyone, but I'm here to ride everyone. If I don't, just here to rip the freaking heads off and uh, just praise God and we're having fun. You made the most of that ride. Well done. Thank you, Kate. Craig. Clarification, of course, he does not mean that in the literal sense. That is just a saying, as he did. Outlaw ripped into that one pretty darn 